What it do, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. You tuned into an episode of Need for Speed Heat. Yeah, you heard it. We bring in a new game to the channel. I'm gonna just try to like at least record like 15 minutes of content for y'all daily. We just gonna see how this go. Um, stay tuned. I do have more Off-Road Outlaws videos on the way. Um, but like I said, I'm gonna just try to give y'all content like 15 minutes a day. I don't really have time to really play the game and do much because I have other channels and I'm in school. Y'all know about that. But yeah, let's just get straight into this video. So I actually had this game when it first came out. My dad pre-ordered it for me. Um, I didn't really play this game. I had new um, payback. Um, I had payback was like the hardest game besides Midnight Club. But um, I really like payback hard because, because you, you could, could um, drag race. You can't really, you can drag race on here, but online, on Payback, that's all you do is drag race. I'm probably, actually, I'm not even going to play Payback now, because I'm going to just tell y'all, um, on Need for Speed Heat, I had every card, like, the, like I was saying earlier, though, like, I had this game beat pretty much. I didn't play it until I moved to Orlando and my roommate started playing it. So, um, with three people playing under the same profile, you know you're going to beat the game pretty fast. We accumulated about 100 cars. Um, everything was good. Payback, bro, I had about 100 cars on Payback. I played Payback for like two years. Um, all that was all me. Um, I got in some trouble with PlayStation or Sony, Rockstar, I'm not sure. But PlayStation banned my original PSN. Um, so I lost all my game storage, um, Payback, Need for Speed Heat, like Grand Theft Auto 5, bro, that really hurt me on GTA 5, cause if y'all kept up with my community post, I was actually finna start posting Grand Theft Auto 5 videos on the channel, um, I know the game is outdated, and if it's not PC, nobody really wanna watch it, but my, um, I had Grand Theft Auto pretty much beat online, I had every garage, every car, you could imagine but i lost all of that lost all my cars on heat payback so i just really stopped playing the game um then no limit came out so i just started playing no limits but i'm gonna just stop talking um and just get into this video so after y'all heard that pretty much we from the bottom let's see we got um we're, i didn't mean to current the car up, but we're level 17 so we don't have no engine swaps. I don't have the option to do any engine swaps. So we just finna do night races. I know how to get money. Stay tuned for them videos. Um, but we just finna do night races and try to get a little rep before the night is over with. So um, let's get into the video. Like I said, I'm only going to do 15 minutes of this because I got a bunch of other stuff to do. I'm setting my alarm clock right now, um, or should I say a timer, but I should have been inside it when I started the video, so maybe a 20 minute video. Let's get it, dude.
Alright, yeah, we just finna skip over here and start the next race. And they won't let me fast travel. Alright, since we can't fast travel and this car is very slow, we finna drift. All right, let's get it.
I don't know if y'all can hear me over this curve, but I was really trying to make that curve before that cop got there. Um, I haven't played in a minute though, so I'm just warming up. Let's see if we can hit a hundred thousand. Look at that. All right, then. Let's see what we got. We finna see if we can make it back to the safe house. Again, I don't know if y'all can hear me. If y'all can't hear me over the car, I may just go back and put captions in so y'all can see what I was trying to say. Made it. This shit don't get any easier, but it never gets old either. You've been approved for some more parts. Check them out. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so we made it back to the garage. I just really wanted to drop off the RP so I don't have to worry about running from the police and losing the little um, RP I did game. Because this Mustang is pretty slow. Um, you see I could barely drift. I think I got some kind of like I got like some kind of drag tires on it probably. Um this here gonna be one of the first cars I built when I had first when I had like all the cars on the game. This is one of the fastest cars um with a specific engine. I do gotta find that engine again. I forgot which one it was. Um same with this car. This car was pretty fast. Um I somewhat redid oh redid it over. Um, it was just like a remix of Brian's car and Too Fast, Too Furious. Um, I had a remix the first time I did it look harder, but you see the, what we have here. Um, I got to put a 5.0 motor in this. Actually, I think it's a 4.0, but it's a V8. But yeah, these are the three cars I'm working with right now, right now because the Mustang was the first car they gave me. So, you know, you got to keep the first car. Um... This gonna be next on the chopping board. This up too, and then we'll just see what we can get into. I have um like two hundred and fifty four thousand dollars, but I don't really want to spend no more money and like parts and buying other cars because they all gonna be slow. Um, cause look at this, I only have Pro Plus parts, like no engines unlocked, but I just want to get all of these unlocked again, and I don't really play the game so. I highly doubt I ever get like the elite plus parts again. Uh, it all depends on how y'all, how this video do. If y'all watch this video, I will grind and get every single part it is upgraded. All the cars. Um, just make sure you like the video, comment, and subscribe. 
Um, but yeah, what I was finna say is like I don't, never, I don't think I'm gonna ever hit that again because I never really hit it to begin with. My other roommates, low key, I want to say they helped me hit it because they kind of did. Um, which they did most of the work. I had like super and super plus parts. Um, then once they played, they got like the elite parts. I think it was like elite plus. Yeah, I guess that's the farthest you can go. But um, I bought an Xbox One just so I can play Midnight Club LA. I'm not sure if y'all remember that game. I'm gonna put in a little clip so y'all can see Midnight Club LA. But um, it is a long story when I bought my Xbox. Like it actually got delivered. I bought it used on eBay. And my address, everything was A1, but the male person, I stay in like an apartment, so I'm in school right now in college. So they put my Xbox in somebody else, like post carrier box. I'm not sure how that stuff worked, but pretty much somebody basically had took delivery of my Xbox and I couldn't get it. But I really wanted to play Midnight Club because they said um, Midnight Club servers was back online. So my roommate, um, he went back to his house um, and like to visit his family or whatever. He asked me if he, I wanted him to bring his Xbox. I told him I really didn't care. Um, it's up to him. He brought it in a way. Um, I bought Midnight Club and played on his Xbox for like a week or two. And then, um, long story short, I caught the um, UPS man. He wasn't even the UPS. It was like um, the US mail, like the postal service. There was at the mailbox again. Luckily, I had parked my car by the mailbox. This is like far away from my building, but luckily I parked my car by the mailbox one day. So I'm just walking back to my car to go find some lunch or whatever. I see his truck there. So I'm like, let me just go talk to him and see if he know where my package is at. Um, Come to find out, it was in somebody else's mailbox. He asked me what was my name. Like he asked me for my ID. I gave him my ID and he saw my name was there, so he gave me my Xbox. But back to what I was saying with Midnight Club, um, I played it like a week on my roommate's Xbox, and then I tried to like just transfer it over to my Xbox, and it didn't work because I bought it under his account. So it looks like he bought it, and I didn't. I don't have pretty much. He has the license to Midnight Club. I don't have it, so I couldn't play it on my game. I got to buy it again, and it's just twenty dollars. But um, cheap broke college student. I'm not really trying to spend that on a video game, um, but we'll see if y'all, which I doubt y'all get in the comments because y'all only like off-road outlaws video, but if you want to see a Midnight Club video on the Xbox, comment that down below, but um, I don't even think I'm going to pull the car out because I done did enough talking, so yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video, um, what I am going to say, I also bought the Xbox to play Forza, um, because I've never played Forza. I always wanted Crown Vicks. I love Crown Vicks. Um, on Forza, especially the old Forzas, you could customize the Crown Vic like you could any other car, make the Crown Vic faster than like any car in the game. But um, I got Forza. Um, I think I'm on Forza 4. So you actually got to buy the Crown Vicks from the auction or whatever. You got to win Crown Vicks. Crown Vicks go for like over a million dollars, bro. I get like fifty thousand dollars max and i'm gonna go buy like an old school cadillac or something so i don't have nowhere near enough money to buy a, a crown vic so i don't even play forza horizon 4 on 4 i have it so i just don't play it y'all um i want us to say i may get bring y'all some forza horizon 5 content to the channel it just all depends on how much time i get um in the upcoming months but yeah um it's your boy whatever the youtube channel name Cause I got a bunch of YouTube channels, bro. Um, what is this? A1 Gaming TV. There you go. We checking out with the video. Um, on game. <laughs> Wait a minute.